Bowled by the Tigers. We're playing for fun. Yorkshire takes on London. Tigers take on the R's as two teams in the championship battle it out with 90 minutes. Yes, today is massive as Hull City take on Queen's Park Rangers in the 42nd round of the most exciting league in the world, the EFL Championship. Now, there's a lot of people on social media worrying and stressed about whether we'll get playoffs. In my eyes, just enjoy the next five games. You know, we've got some fantastic loan players we'll never see again, so just make the most of it. Norwich are comfortably ahead of us. Just enjoy the football, you know, have a bit of a sing-song, have a drink, enjoy yourselves. The last competitive fixture, we lost. Um, just, we'll move on. It wasn't a very pleasant day. I threw up on the way there, got threatened to be stabbed and then lost 2-0. Oh, Today, for the second last time of the season, we're at home, we're at the MKM, and we're there to back the boys in black and amber. It's quite upsetting, really, but we'll make the most of it. I'll see you when we get down there. It'll be about an hour journey. Up the Tigers! Right. Off we pop. It's a beautiful day for it. Oses! Don't know why I put a cockney accent on. It's Grand National today. I'm looking forward to it. Whoa, what just got race? Just seen me first ever falcon. Pretty cool. Flew straight no. in front of us. No? No, it was something a lot bigger than a falcon. Maybe an eagle. Why has England got one side which just looks lovely and then you've just got massive black clouds? Wet wang. What a name that is, honestly. Weekly segment, Mum. Is Jaden scoring? No. Who is? We'll take that as a 2 0 win. <laughs> I usually record a bit in Otter, but to be honest, there's not a lot to Otter about. It's just raining. It's a bit of a glum day, really. Grandma! Hello, Marcus. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Are you okay? I'm good, thank you, Grandma. Now, today, Hull yeah. City versus Queen's Park Rangers. What's your score prediction? Oh, I think Hull might win today. I'll say 2-1. Ah, oh, brilliant. Nobody else needs to upstairs. Hello, Marcus. Hello, Grandad, how are you? What's your score predictions, Grandad? Hull versus QPR. Well, I never play very well against lower teams. Uh, and I'm not optimistic as we played, and I think it'll be a one all draw. <laughs> A lot of people wearing a coat and shorts. Now, I'm not one to judge people. But you're either too warm or too cold. It makes no sense to me. Up them tigers. We're nearly there. The sun is shining. But can we get the three points? Sound like I'm on a podcast there. I don't know. Well, I'll have to wait and see. I can't really see any child. Child? Ch I don't know. Is she there? No, she's not. That's heartbreaking. I have a massive crush on the woman that works on Walton Street car park. I don't know her name because I'm too awkward to say anything, but she's very pretty. Hi, Mum. <laughs> and here it is then. That tiger is very impressive. Look at that. Steve, 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 Steve. Oh, thank you, man. I appreciate it. Where's my season ticket? I think I've lost my season ticket. Oh, we're in. Ooh. Like it's 1966. Yeah. What a song. What a stadium. What a man Thomas is. Just met Elias Chair. Lovely fella. Smells incredible. And I got a photo with him. <laughs> incredible. I featured it on the vlog before, but what an incredible talented artist Leo is. That is just, oh, it's amazing, man. Well, I am still doing my runs, but you can have a bit of chicken. You know, it's good to have cheap meals, I think. He was going to try and hide it, but he ended up eating a burger with a fork. You know, you can hide it now. No, so. What was last? <laughs> Leeds are losing at home. What is going on? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hello and welcome. We're here at the MKM Stadium for, unfortunately, the second last game of the season. I'm looking forward to it, you know. We're just going to make the absolute most of it. Playoffs is going to be difficult, there's no doubt about it, but we can just enjoy ourselves. It takes a lot of pressure off the players' shoulders, gives the fans a chance to just have a sing song and enjoy the rest of the season. Now, the lineup has just been announced, and all there is to say 
is Liam Dollar is back. Oh, I'm just so buzzing. He's on the bench for the first time in four months. What's your score predictions, Liam? Short and sweet, I like it. Um, well, I put on battle today. Both teams to score, Hunter win. I'm going to go 2 1 0. Fabio and. But we don't promote betting. No, I think it's going to be 3 1 All City. I'm going to be optimistic. I think Ilias Cher will score for them. I think for us, Regan Slater, Jean Michel Seri again, and Jaden. It has to be Jaden. He's back! Tilapi's back! I'm buzzing! Don't mean a lot, we've got five games left, but he's back! We try and get a wave of one of the players. Now, we're joined with the main man, Lucas. How have you been? I'm going to have a nice chip butter if you're ready for the game. <laughs> Ollie, what's your score predictions? Uh, well, I can say we'll win every week at the moment, I've noticed, uh, so we're not. Uh, it's going to be 1-1. One, one. Uh, Who's scoring? Very boring. Um, Philogene and Elias again. Now we're joined with Phil. Score predictions, my friend. Hi, Marcus. Well, it's an interesting one today, so I'm going to go with 5 3. Because 10 years ago today, Wall City played in the FA Cup semi final with Big Sheffield United. So, probably history will repeat itself with 5 3 and Pillage Hatch. Brilliant! Oh, <laughs> Get the trousers up. What will be a six hour drive to Hull? That is some incredible support from QPR. Very, very well done. For a team that's, you know, battling relegation, but also in a sense quite safe. It's, it's incredible. I tell you what, every week we get more and more flags in the South Stand. Next thing you know, the full stand will be waving them loud and proud. We'll be able to see a thing. Still doing my justice for Adama Traore. I love the guy to bits, man. Well, here we have it then. As referees take <laughs> all City take on QPR, I'm buzzing for this. Honestly, I'm so looking forward to this. Oh, this is nice. Take your kids to the game day. I love that. All right, I'm all good now. Connolly is having a chat with Adama. I just love Adama. Go on, Seri. Just Seri. Just cheering Seri on. I'm just a Seri fan. For I can't help falling with you. And it will be. Is that Jeff Hendricks? <laughs> Fair enough. QBR taking kickoff. Way up, one minute. Give us a chance to sit down. It makes you think what's Noah Ohio doing in training to not even get a place on the bench over an under 21s player? Please don't score, Jeff. It'd mean a lot if you didn't, mate, truly. Well, I'll give you a pat on the back and a round of applause. <laughs> oh. oh, no. Fanta spilled down me. I weed myself. <laughs> I could have done, and I've just blamed it on the Fanta, but I haven't. A bit wet, don't you think, Mum? It's a bit damp. <laughs> oh, my neck. I knew we needed the three points, but I didn't think we'd bring goalkeeper up for five-minute corner. Shoot! Ah! 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 Yes! What the bloody neck was that? It was a goal. Oh, what a goal it was! <laughs> I think that's up there. With the top two I've seen in the last few months. What? Oh, Jaden. I like Jaden. Jaden! Sometimes people have a go at Jaden for when he shoots, and now people having a go at when he passes. He can't win, bless him. Boom. Mother, how are you? What's he doing? What's he doing down there? Corner, come on! It's clear to see we're playing with a lot of pressure off our shoulders. We're just, we're flying. Not really, but we're doing well. Marty, Jacob, he played for Pickering. He's... Go on, Jaden! Oh, go on then, Ozan. <laughs> oh, 
this is genuinely some of the best football I've seen. The way we're playing it around here. It's like men versus boys. This is incredible. Corner again. Adama's happy. I'm happy. He's smiling. I'm smiling. What a bloke. It's slightly late, but player to watch, I've gone for Ilias Chair. I think he's just one of the better players in the squad. Either him or Chris Willock. But I'm, and you know what? I'll go Chris Willock. Because we're linked to him. And I hope we sign him in summer. Oh! Yeah! Come on! Fabio! It was a good goal! I didn't get it on video. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I'm gooded. I'm not gooded. I'm buzzing. We scored, but. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Off we go. <laughs> I got one of the goals on camera. I'm trying. <laughs> Let me try and explain what happened. Fabio got the ball, and he was about, say, there. And he just chipped it over the goalkeeper into the back of the net. I'm sure my incredible description there will make you imagine the goal. <laughs> we are all, we are all, we are all, Say, I am, say, my all, I I'm trying to sing. <laughs> oh, what a fella. The day Omar scores, I'm going to go wild. He's uh, deserved about 10 this season. He's you just... Love him. You love him. I love him. I do. <laughs> I love half the time. I'd say I love most of the time. I love that. everyone. <laughs> oh, we've changed it. Doherty. Why are we singing about Greg Doherty? Is he warming up or something? Oh, he is. No matter. I'm slightly worried for Jack Colback. He was on the bench for QPR about 10, 15 minutes ago and he went to the toilet, I presume. Or he went inside the tunnel and he hasn't returned yet. Either he's got extremely bad diarrhoea or he's hurt himself. We'll, we'll hope for the first because we don't want no injuries. Oh, you know it's good when grandma double texts. <laughs> 40th minute, I haven't really done a lot of talking. I've just enjoyed this game. It is just beautiful. The way we're playing, we just need to treasure it because it doesn't happen often. But when it does, it's a magnificent to watch. Weekly thanks to the linesmen. Still not really sure what they do, but they do a good job of what they do. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Nearly missed something. What a half of football this has been, honestly. I enjoyed it. You didn't feel nervous from minute one. I've just felt relaxed watching the game. <laughs> Two minutes added on. That does not look good. He is limping. And there it is, what an half of football. Half time 2-0. You cannot complain with that. Half time 2-0. Honestly, just incredible. Like, what a half of football. In terms of halves of football, it's a lot of halves of football. It's been probably the best half of football in the halves of football that I've seen this season. When you look at the stats, it looks like a really evenly matched game. I mean, 53% possession for us. We've only had five shots and three on target and scored two of them. But when you actually watch it, the way we're playing, it just looks like we're the more dominant side. I feel like QPR have had a lot more of the ball because they're hitting us on the counter attack and they're playing it from the back sometimes. But realistically, I think we could go and get four or five here. And that is me being very optimistic for someone who isn't very optimistic at some times. Look, I don't want to be that guy that is over optimistic now. But I look at this league table, right? We win today, we go four points off Norwich, we go to seven, and we have got a game in the hand. Now, that is just mind-blowing. I know I've said on so many occasions, the season's over, but it might not be, you never know. By the looks of things, they're bringing two subs on. All right, well, is it Jimmy Dunn? That rings a bell. Summit done. he's coming off. And 25, I, I don't know. Subs. And it will be Tyler Martin to take kick off. Sounded very enthusiastic there over a second half kickoff. That was not good. Two fans at the other side of the pitch and you could hear him scream as it went down. I hope it's just one of them football moments where he just thought he might get a free kick and not that he's actually injured. For the first time in four months, the reception when Liam Delap comes and warms up. 
<laughs> Come on. <laughs> We want you just stay. Jaden! Come on! That is just naughty. That is just naughty. Go on, Jaden! Come on! Mold by the Tigers. We're all off to Premier League. Villa Jane, Jaden. Villa Jane. Jaden, run it. Is down is from the Brazilian. Mother's horse came second in the Grand National. Are you happy with that, Mum? Yeah. Buzzing with it. I am Maximus has won, which is Phil's horse. So you know, win-win. Takeaways for the week. Oh no. Oh, Suck it around everyone. And he still missed. What the booming has happened there? No way. No way. Jaden! Oh, get off! This is just quality. Oh, I'm loving it. What a balloon. You know, it keeps bouncing on, it keeps going, it's just incredible. The balloon has made its way onto the pitch. Oh, <laughs> blooming heck. Nearly got strampeded on. Oh, City on my mind. Rosie's playing the way that City should. There's a black balloon now. Causing no harm. Keep it there. Uh, no! I've changed my opinion on the lino. It's disgusting. Absolutely disgraceful. There's no need for that in football. You know, we come here as fans. We shouldn't see things like that. Justice for the balloon. Ah, Orange John's back, no matter. We're all happy again. He's coming on! Liam Dubop, he's back! Start break. Number 15 for QPR has burst that balloon. And he did it on purpose, it was disgusting. Come on! Stand innovation. The laugh is back! Oof. This game is just incredible. It keeps still nil between Norwich and Preston. We've got a chance. Yeah. Who's been your man of the match? Awesome. Brilliant. To love! To love! No! <laughs> There's 15 minutes left and I just don't want it to end. Like there's some games you just want it to end so we can either get the three points or just go home, but I'm enjoying it that much. We're playing so well, man. Like, Delap's come on, made a huge difference. Villagey's nearly had another. This could have been in double figures. It's just incredible. Oh, well, yeah, maybe not double figures, but... <laughs> oh, what a touch by Amber. No, oh, he's been escorted out now. Poor fella. Mum, full-time score predictions. Fair enough. <laughs> it's all that's coming on! <laughs> it shouldn't be that exciting. But I'm running! It's <laughs> over! I think I was on luck to me then. That was awkward. <laughs> oh, Adama! Adama! Then the Dykes comes off. Fabio and Sari come off. They've just been incredible, honestly. It's going to be sad not seeing Fabio in a whole year next season. He just deserves so much, man. Look at him. What a guy. Do -do -do -do. He's on. He's on. He's on. No. It's armor. Hey, up. Oh, no. After what happened last time, I'm not touching that ball. Another substitution. Tyler Martin comes off. And Cyrus Drifty comes on. Oh, I love Tyler Martin as well. I love half the team. Tyler Martin, baby. Ty oh, I'm not going to start singing. Five minutes added on. We can't let it slip, can we? 
<laughs> you never know. Uh, Norwich have scored, which puts us, again, six points off them. Uh, it's just... It's going to be a long battle, but this is a big three points. We've still got a game in hand. At least we didn't lose today, eh? Fair play, though, to QPR. I hope they stay up. To be honest, this second half has been very, very much dominant by QPR. I think if it was nil nil at our time, we would be in a lot of trouble at this point. <laughs> oh, go on, Dalla. Don't be injured, don't be injured, don't be injured. Woo! There we go. Full time, all we'll save three. QPR nil. What a win. And that man there deserves all the plaudits. Ozan Tufan, what a guy. Wow, what a game. Hull City 3, QPR 0. Honestly, probably the best performance I've seen from Hull at home for the last year. It has just been absolutely incredible. It's everything we've been working towards for months, just packed into one game. The way we played, them goals, they were just all absolutely incredible. I just love this club, man. And Adama Traore. Now, truth be told, I don't look at the league table because it kind of scares me. But all the very best to QPR for the rest of the season. Hopefully, you're able to stay up. When I say I don't look at the league table, I don't know whether you're already comfortably safe. But if you aren't, I really hope you're able to get out of the relegation dogfight and get back into the championship in the next season. I say that, you're still in the championship. You know what I mean. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe and turn on notifications. It would genuinely mean the absolute world. It's been a true pleasure taking you to the MKM to watch a fantastic win. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your weekend and I'm off to go to the toilet. My spaghetti pasta bake has gone straight through me. Too much information. Bye-bye.